with me? Is this a train to Lymington? Yes, I think it is, next stop. Oh. May I? Oh, thanks a lot. confession to make. Really? I knew it was a train to Limington all along. I just wanted you to help with my bag. I see. You're not cross then? Not at all. Why should I be? Bit of a cheek though, isn't it? sat here so that you could see me from the platform. Then I quite intentionally caught your eye, holding your gaze just long enough to reassure you I was an honest sort of chap. You took the bait. Here we are. On our way to Lymington. No, Dunstable. Dunstable? You said this was a train to Lymington. I was lying. Lying? Whatever for? It's a habit of mine. I'm a habitual liar. Oh, you should be ashamed of yourself, telling lies like that. Oh, come, come. What was the first thing you did on entering the carriage? You asked me whether this was the train to Lymington, and then moments later you confessed you knew it was the train to Lymington all along. So either your first question contained an implicit falsehood, or your second statement was an out-and-out -out lie. Either way, it seems a thoroughly dishonest way to treat a fellow traveller. You can talk. Anyway, why should I believe you now? The guard told me this was the train to Lymington. I suppose he's a habitual liar too. No, he's just greedy. Like many government officials, he's susceptible to the lure of a shilling. So I bribed him. You bribed him? To tell me this was the train to Lymington? So I'd get into this carriage and you could humiliate me? Not really, no. What do you mean? Actually, I've been fibbing. The whole thing's a complete fabrication from beginning to end. And here we are at Livington, just as you'd hoped. Clear off your head. Nonsense. I just thought it would help pass the time. Let me give you a hand. No, thanks. I can manage. There you are, you see. Another untruth. You should be more careful. It might become a habit. <laughs> 